Hello, I'm David Hibbert, and I've got some good news for you. Here's how Paul Sohn explained the gospel, the good news of Jesus Christ. The Bible says in Romans chapter 3, verse 23, For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. According to this verse, all of us have sinned against God. This includes not only the big sins, like rape and murder, but also smaller things, like cruelty, insensitivity towards others, losing our temper, cheating, self-centeredness. You know, I'm willing to admit to doing some of these things. How about you? Well, the Bible also says in Romans chapter 6, verse 23, the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life in Christ Jesus our Lord. So according to this verse, those little wrongdoings that you and I just admitted to have earned us a penalty, and that penalty is death. But the good news is in the same verse that God has offered us a gift, and that gift is eternal life. We can freely receive God's forgiveness and His pardon from our death penalty that we owe. That penalty has already been paid for by Jesus' death on the cross. And like any other gift, we can't earn it. We can only receive it. How do we receive it? Well, let's look at one more verse. Romans chapter 10, verse 3 says, Everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved. Do you see how simple it is to receive God's gift? All we have to do is to recognize the fact that we have sinned and we deserve death because we sinned against the holy and righteous God. And then we call out to God and we humbly ask for His forgiveness and the new life that He's offering to us. That's what I did a number of years ago, and I'd like to encourage you to do the same. And that is your good news for today. God bless you.